right now. Good morning out there to the grind. Good morning out there to the grinders. Get out of good morning out there to the go-getters. Good morning out there to the people that work from home, own their own business out there, you know, doing what it takes to, to make a difference in their, in their family's lives, in their own lives. You subscribe that you can win for yourself. You can put the work ethic in for what you want in your life and what you want to do with your life. So you work from home. You have an opportunity to develop an income from home, but it's a daunting task transitioning from work, right, to home work where you can discipline yourself to, to do the work that it takes. So, you know, in, in doing so, I'm gonna share a little bit about how you work from home effectively, efficiently, successfully. Tips from the key man. Uh, this is just a, a moment of, of Grindology 101. I am Dr. Grind. I believe that the work that we do, we may forget, but the work will never forget you, right? So you could work yourself into a position that uh, waiting for somebody else to do something for you that it will never happen, right? So here's here's a little bit of tips. It's gonna be real quick and brief. Hopefully we make an impact on somebody's life today uh, about working from home, doing what you do. You own your own business. You you're in pursuit of success. You, whatever it is, it's even maintaining your family life. You know, in this time that everybody's home. So welcome to the grind because it's gonna take some work and it's gonna take some time. But check this out. It's about getting up in the morning. You know, people you hear, oh, I'm not a morning person. Uh, I don't like to get my day started like that or whatever the case might be. Like, but, but guess what? If God gave you a new chance on a new day, you ought to wake up and embrace it with the most impactful power that you could ever imagine. Man, he gave you a new day. He gave you a new chance. He gave you a new way to be better than you were yesterday. So I suggest wake up early. But well, maybe you're a night out, so that don't work for you. Same concept, right? apply that, that extra time to what you want to do. Uh, waking up early is one of the secrets of success for the top income earners, the top difference makers in the world, all the way around the world for all times. Um, as you can see, if you start early, I believe that momentum builds on itself. So if you start on momentum early in the morning, imagine here on the West Coast, it, early in the morning might be four in the morning. That might be early. But on the East Coast, that's 7 o'clock in the morning. They're about to start their day. They, they, they might be even a little bit late, depending on their commute. But how about at 9 o'clock on the East Coast, at 6 o'clock here, they're already at the stock market about to make decisions on how much money you need to spend for the products that you like. So just as a, a tip to you. So here's uh, seven keys to successfully work from home. Wake up early, right? Uh, make your bed. Oh, something about making your bed is, is, is amazing in itself. It gives you structure, it gives you discipline, it gives you something that you do naturally every day. But a work environment of success, you know, how do you work? How, 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 what's your uh, area of work look like? Like at work, you don't have a cluttered area at work. Why would you have a cluttered area at home where you work? Tackle the most important tasks first. Uh, what, what that means is, is, is don't procrastinate. Just tackle that thing. Just jump right on top of it. You, you'd be uh, uh, amazed at what you could do by just jumping on stuff. Now, hold yourself accountable. Have a schedule and stick to it. But uh, daily tasks, right? Uh, a list of things to do. If you write it down, you could get it down. Uh, but you can't have a, a minimum wage, uh, a, a wage work ethic with a multi-million dollar, you know, plan and goal. This is just not going to work. So those keys right there to work, you know, you got to grind, you got to get up, you got to, you got to put yourself in position to where uh, people that ordinarily, you know, would not do the work, you, you just a passive. Maybe they're ahead of you. Maybe people are a little bit more polished than you are. Maybe you don't know all of the things that it takes, but the, when you work, doors open for you. When you grind, doors open for you. When people will see your work and say, hey, you're doing some work, let me help you. But you got to do the work. That's the one thing about it. This is a little um, uh, structure of just a generic template of, you know, what a schedule would look like if you put it together for yourself. You know, just, just the systems. It's, it's very difficult. But think about it at work. You, you know, when you go to work, you start work at nine o'clock. Between nine and eleven thirty or eleven o'clock, when you get your first break, there's a certain amount of tasks that you need to take care of. If you don't handle those tasks, 
uh, a manager, a supervisor, whoever that might be, lead, they kind of come over to your area, depending on how they are, come over there real cool, or they come over there real stern, if you haven't done what you were accountable to do between those hours before break. Here's a case in point. Hey, uh, Brenda, uh, pretty cool day. I see you got uh, having a good conversation. Did you get that email out? That might be one style. Listen, it's almost break time. You didn't get, but he did get that email out, but that's at work. Can you be disciplinary into yourself at home? That's that's the breakthrough part, right? But it's focus, focus, not hocus pocus. So a, a great leader and a mentor, a business developer all around the world uh, put this on me some, some time ago. It, it, it's consistency all the time. You're always on this, this focus on what you want to do and, and staying away from distractions. You got to get that for yourself. It's, it's, there's no other breakthrough better than being able to focus, but you can't cheat the grind. You, you, you can't, you can't uh, out talk it. You can't out work. You can't do none, none of those kind of deals. You must, you must produce in the grind. The only thing that produces out of the grind is the work. It, it, there's nothing else besides the work. Now, in working from home, though, you, you, you take your breaks just like at work. Don't stress. You got to believe in your process. You got to believe in where you're going. You got to believe in what you're doing. See, the work ethic is innately your own. You own your work ethic. I don't care what it is that you do. You can be a part of anything or do anything. It doesn't matter at all, but your work ethic, your own. So when you work with an ethic that, that says you're going to do more than, than maybe what you're paid, you're going to be earlier than what you're accountable to, because guess what? Over time, if you do more than what you're paid to do, you get paid for more than what you do. But take your breaks as you believe in the process. You, just like the grind, it's not because you got to grind. It's because you get to grind. But here, back to this. Declutter. This top version of, of this example right here, you, you, how could you find? But some people find functionality in situations like that. Me, myself, I need to have a clear uh, uh, working environment. To, but it gets cluttered because you're working, right? But you, you got to have some way you can reach what you're looking for, right? That, that's, that's very important. Now, these work ethics right here, you could add your own determination, create grind, commitment, tenacity, focus, uh, uh, overcoming spirit, you know, uh, uh, conviction to win, all of those other characteristics. You know, you put those into what you want to do with your life. But what I want to tell you here is you never stop trying. You look at this example right here. You've seen it before. And the guy here on, on the bottom, man, he just came to it. He's been doing this tough so long. And, and like we always like to say, you know, how long? You should be driving a Bentley by now. You should be doing this by now. You should be, no, you should be continuing your process right now. Don't quit. You never know when the breakthrough is going to come. If you get anything from this, get that. Look at the guy on the top. Will it continue? It's inevitable that you get to where you're going if you never stop going where you're going. So I want you to get my seven keys to success. It's really uh, brief, very powerful information on uh, just taking some practical steps to your success. So seven keys to success, practical principles for personal achievement. Start now. Use what you have. Control what you know. Complete what you start. Execute your plan. Share your success and stand for something. That's all I want to do is just impact and empower. I believe it's a, it's a great work. You can read it on a flight to the next uh, business event. You can get some tips out of it and, and absolutely be a blessing to someone just by getting it and giving it to them. Now, this book right here, uh, you can get online at the website, kijanoans.com. And if you text 909-686-1698 and you text seven keys, I will email you, I will contact you, I'll email you an additional, uh, what they call unspeakable value, even this course right here on working from home where you can have uh, the PDF version of it. Thank you for the time in this morning. Hope you have a phenomenal day. Uh, I'm excited about some things that are coming. And Dr. Grind is, is definitely on time. Uh, the grindology, uh, that it, it takes uh, what I'm coining is grindism, 
you know, the philosophy of what it takes to, to have the, the drive to get to where you're going, the commitment to get to where you're going, the focus to get to where you're going, the belief that you're going to get there and not applying your energy to the result, but the process, that's the grind. You know you're going to get there. Go to grindology101.com. There's some information coming there. It's going to be some great processes uh, of learning and, and um, developing right there. So I thank you for your time this morning. Man, out there in, in internet land, if you're not online operating in business, if you're not online in e-commerce, if you're not paying attention to the market trend, now this is off the grid or on the PowerPoint presentation or any of that right there. If you're not online in e-commerce, you're out of line. You're not in line with what's happening. There's a market shift happening. There's uh, information that's going on right now of people that's making the transition. And if you want 50 million people like many of us, 50 million people waiting for someone to tell them what's going to happen next. And some of us have tried to make what's happening next for ourselves. So, you know, pay attention to what's going on. Any way that, that we can connect, you can reach out to me at 909-686-1698. You send me a text, seven keys. I'm going to get you some information. We'll connect and um, I'll email you this a PowerPoint presentation on effectively working from home. You have a phenomenal day. You succeed on purpose. It has been a moment with the key man, the Dr. Grind and the Grindology. Hope you have a great day. Succeed on purpose. Success loves speed. I see it's the top because the bottom is just too crowded. And do your thing. Absolutely.